What is going on guys? My name is Poison Gaming YT and welcome back to my Let's Build a Mini Game World. I believe this is episode 7. Wow, we're getting in there in this series. And in today's video, I'll be giving a shout out to Greg in the Hoodie because he's been helping out on a load of the different worlds that I've been playing in and he's been a big help and he actually suggested uh, a mini game that I should build and he said The Dropper. And then I thought, um, well, the dropper is kind of like a big game, you know, it's got a lot of steps and a um, really big design and stuff. So I may start a series where I build all the bigger games, like dropper, maybe a cops and robbers. So tell me what you guys think in the comments about that idea. And uh, yeah, so in this episode, we're going to make an action game, and it is called Tower Drop. And uh, it's a really fun game. If you don't know what it is, uh, there's a PC version, you can go check it out. But um, I'm not really sure what I'm going to make it out of, I didn't really plan so much for this one. But uh, I think I'm going to use stone and hmm, let's go lime green wool to make it look fancy. Actually, you know what? I'll use lime green for this one. So, oh, I got a lot of stuff in here. Just clear my inventory with this. So, let's get the stone out and let's go uh, lapis. Yeah, we haven't used too much blue in this yet. And we're going to go, we're going to have to try to make a good square. So, let's put that there and let's count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Is 10 good enough? Yeah, 10 is good. So that's 10 in between, right? So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Is that right? Did I do it wrong? Hold on. <laughs> 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Right, yeah, we're good. So now we're just going to drag all this all around here to make a beautiful, pretty little square. And it's not a very big mini game like that, but it, it just towers up all the way to the top of the uh, world. So let me just get a swiftness potion right here. There we go. And we're just gonna go up. Up we go. Bam, bam, bam. The world looks awesome from this height. Look at that. Look at all those mini games. And let's see how high this actually is. I never really built one on the new improved uh, world height. It used to be like much lower. Now it's like double what it used to be. So let's see how high we can go with this. I can already see the stars through the ground. Lol. All right, we're going. We're going a lot higher than I thought we'd be going. All right, so this is this is as high as it can go, I believe. Yep. All right, now that is really really tall. It would take a long time to build all that. So I gotta cut it somewhere. Where do you think is a good spot to cut it? I still want it really tall. So I'll keep it all the way up until, hmm, let's go all the way up until here. That's, I think that's pretty good. So let's break all this, and let's go jump down once we break all this. Wow, there's a lot more than I thought. Alright, there we go. So let's, oh, we missed that. So I guess we're just going to keep building here, and I'm just going to cut until I finish uh, these walls, which might take a long, long time. So I just finished the walls, and I put some lava down there, and a lot of you guys are probably thinking like, Oh my god, what are you building? Oh my god, oh my god, it looks so ugly. Um, it might look ugly, yes, I agree with you, it does look pretty ugly, big tower in the sky. It might look cool to some people, but um, it's tower drop, and if you don't know what tower drop is, basically, you're on the top of this tower, and then you say go, whatever, um, I don't know, just fly up to the top real quick, alright, you say go, and then you gotta jump down on these little platforms that I'm gonna make right now. These little glowstone platforms. And you wanna try to get to the bottom of the thing as fast as possible before anybody else does. And you can't just jump all the way down because then you just fall in the lava. So you gotta slowly make your approach all the way down. And it is lots of fun. I've played it with some friends in other worlds. Other, you know, tower drops that I've built. And so yeah, I'm just gonna fill all this up. And uh, this video is probably going to be really short for you guys, but I'm re I've been recording for almost uh, 40 minutes now. It's been crazy. I've been, like, you know, editing and crap. All the good stuff. So, uh, I'm just going to place it all in random spots. And there's also going to be some chests. You might find um, some food in there, maybe a bow and arrow if you're lucky. If you're very lucky. You have to be very lucky to find that bow. Maybe some uh, feather falling boots, which would be helpful. And I'm really just not even paying attention to my screen, I'm just kind of placing around. There we go. Get some more on this side. What side is the least? This side is the least. 
I wish um, 4J Studios added the texture pack Faithful in uh, Minecraft, Xbox, and PlayStation. And if you know what Faithful is, it's basically an HD version of the, uh, what's it called? Nat new uh, what's it? Neutral? Default. It's the default texture pack. Um, so the pixels will be smaller, a lot more detail into them, and it looks just much better. I would definitely use that for everything I do. Never change it. I would definitely buy it too, because it looks the best out of all the texture packs I've played on. And uh, we got some, we got a lot of ways to go. So, play some more over here. I don't want them sticking out like that. There we go. Maybe we can put some cakes on some of these. So it'd be like a, just a quick eat and then just jump back down. More. We need more glowstone. I'm doing glowstone because it lights up as you go. And it's a lot help, very helpful. Um, instead of putting like tor torches in the inside, you can just put glowstone as the things. Could have also done uh, lapis blocks, but that'd be so boring. So original. Everyone would be expecting that. Glowstone actually kind of looks pretty cool from inside. This game does look pretty cool. Uh, but we still got a long, long way to go. Until we're down here. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to do one, one wall at a time. So it would be a little faster. Alright, here we go. Oh no, we're in the clouds. We might have to turn them off when you play this game. And uh, episode 10, I'll be doing a special episode. It'll be with subscribers. We'll be playing most of these mini games, not all of them, but all 10 of the mini games that we built. We'll pick about maybe eight or nine of them, and we'll all play them. And then everybody gets a shout out with that. All the subscribers that help me uh, make that video and help me play the games, they'll all get a shout out. But if you already have a shout out, then you can't get another one on the board. But uh, in separate series, you can get more and more. You just keep, you know. Posting nice comments or something, doing something nice. But if you keep spamming me, then I won't. Ha I probably won't uh, give you another shout out or give you another or give you a shout out at all. So don't spam. No spamming. Those are the rules. That's the Poisonopolis laws or the Poison City, whatever. I'm gonna call this. I don't know. I don't know what to call my world. Right now, it's just called mini games. <laughs> Let's build a mini game. No, my glowstone! Oh, now I'm upset. All right, where is glowstone? It's in the decoration. Now it's here. All right, so I'm just gonna cut until I um get all this again. Okay, so um I just finished all the glowstone, and that took a while. We've been recording for about 15 minutes now crazy but the video is probably gonna be like 10 minutes long and now we're gonna go all the way back to the top here maybe about here and uh so put some chests and now um for chests we're gonna do some boots not not put too many chests uh, let's put one all the way down here and let's get a um let's get a melon <laughs> quick melon slice let's go all the way down here and let's get um let's get a stone a wooden sword. So if you meet up at, meet up with anybody, knock them down. And in this chest we'll have a bow, but no arrows. Arrows you have to get separate, which will be down here. And we'll put one arrow, so you have one shot. And then right here, let's get a potion of um you know a potion of poison, quick one. That'll be annoying. And then over here, let's get a cake. So let's put a cake right here, and if you need hunger, there you go, and then the final chest, right there, and that will be an ender pearl, because that would kind of suck if you uh, landed right here, not much, to, not many places to go, except for, you know, quick dip, <laughs> dip in the lava, so that's pretty much this game, guys, so, um, kind of ugly, I'll fix it up, um, a little bit, put some lighting around it. But uh, thank you guys for watching. This has been Poison Gaming YT. Comment down below if you want to get a shout out. And if you already have a shout out on this board, you can't get another one. But um, comment down below if you want a shout out. And I uh, thank you guys for watching. This has been Poison Gaming YT. And I'll see you guys later.